Hey love bugs, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Prada Magai. Thank you so much for tuning in. If you are new on this channel, please like, comment, and subscribe. Today we will be doing a mukbang. As you can see, I have these lovely food in front of me. So yeah, and I'll be also doing confessions, like because guys, I know how much you love things, so I got you guys covered. So. Firstly, here we have a Street Toys 5, and over here it is a Rapster, and this her one of my faves, which is so that dumb to wings, of course. Mm. Yeah, so please guys don't forget to follow me on my social media networks which is Facebook and Instagram and Twitter, the details right here on the screen. So let's get right on to the questions. Anonymous number one says, I like him but I think I fucked up by chilling with his cousin. <laughs> okay. Look, you know, so let me pull this here. You know, like, right now, I'm asking myself too many questions. I, I don't understand. First thing, does the cousin like you as well, or does he have a crush on you? And where was your boyfriend when you and the cousin met or when you eventually got to like the guy? Because I don't understand where at a groove or he actively introduced you to him. I, I just don't understand. I don't get it, you know. And you know, guys, you must learn to set boundaries because your boyfriend's family and friends, they are not yours. So you must just stick to your lane and don't get mixed up with any of the people that I mentioned, which is the family and the friends. Because it's going to backfire, you know? You're going to be the joke at the end of the day. Because it might happen, let's, okay, God forbid, let's hope the guy is not playing your boyfriend I mean so if your let's say your boyfriend doesn't really love you and then you decide to go for the cousin and leave the boyfriend can you imagine them having a chat a guy chat about you conversing about you I'm pretty sure that you're not gonna like that so it's very uh, this is shady if you like the cousin this is Puma Ulomoyo because 
Yeah. And then I'm also about two. So it's, I think the kitchen is strong. <laughs> All right. So stop it now.
What? Why are you texting the guy? Mm -mm, no, man. Don't do that to yourself, too. Next time, please leave him alone. Please. Anonymous number five. Kaiser's mm -hmm. food is delicious. Yeah. I haven't had anything to eat today, so. I didn't, I didn't eat anything because I was looking for like for making this video and eating with you and in front of you. So, I'm going to take a movie. At least I'm, I'm giving you guys some bites here. Yeah? So, really? Okay. Anonymous number five says my boyfriend and I have been dating for six months and we decided a week ago that we would take it to the next level. While we moved in while we moved into intercourse, I controllably farted. <laughs> We laughed it off and decided to try again. After a little bit, I started. We decided to stop, and I was extremely embarrassed. Girl, I wish I'm not normal. Perhaps, maybe. I mean, if you keep on like continuously farting and releasing gases then maybe you need to clean up you know but hey at the same time i believe you put in like so at this point i don't feel sorry for the guy because farting is just a natural thing and i preferably prefer farting than to burp, you know. It's like I prefer releasing the the gas on my behind than on my mouth. So I'm with you, but the only thing I can advise you to do is you know, to call the traditional route and speak to Amukata. Who's a Amukata? I'm not cut again. But seriously, like if the farting led to led you guys to a point of stopping the the intercourse, that seriously means that you are releasing a bad gas. I mean <laughs> poor guy, shame man. <laughs> I fixed the situation before a tatty shot left to more guy. You don't mind to see that right being right, so fix it. And then my sister said, so I broke up. My ex broke up with me because I was broke, and now they are showing her feelings. And I'm no longer broke, as she said, I was. Chiggy chiggy. Hey, <laughs> chiggy chiggy. Happy, happy. Um, to say you put my love back. I have a new lesson to ask. You. Why are you going to put my back now? Because of the Masham Kurs. Yes, we all love Masham Kurs. But can you imagine enjoying your money with somebody that stood, that stood by you through thick and thin and during your hustling days? So, if she didn't stick around while you didn't have money, she's probably going to leave as soon as the money runs out, if it does. So, to be on the safe side, to be on the safe side, I think you should just, I don't know.
some guys, they are not too much of talk talkative people. So, you anonymous, if you are the type of guy, maybe you should just send the song to your girl, okay, your ex girlfriend, and let the song do the talking for you because I'm like, you know, this artist or this song, he made sure that he sends the message. So, if you just send the song to her, she'll definitely listen and hear out the lyrics. When I'm body up, no more black or something like that. Next anonymous says, I love my wife, but sometimes I can't put up with how hairy her chin and upper lip is. One day, I had enough of looking at it, so I shaved it while she was sleeping. <laughs> she realized two days later that she had no hair on her chin and lip and thought her prayers were answered. Now it's grown even worse and she doesn't know why. No. <laughs> Shame, man. That was thoughtful of you. I mean, clearly, you saw like your wife also didn't like the hair. So, it was very thoughtful of you. My advice to you is not to tell her that you did it. Because now you guys are gonna fight fight you guys are gonna fight over the fact that now her hair is growing faster, yeah, more than the normal rate it was growing. So why not just keep on doing the job and doing the things while she's sleeping and show her. But but do make sure that she doesn't wake up because sooner or later one day she's gonna wake up and she'll find that you are the one but maybe when she does but you can spin the situation you know and thought that Mr. and I thought that you you would help her out since she was so happy you know just turn the tables make up plan as a guy you should know what to do the next anonymous says this man is trying to fly me out but i'm home and i have a strict mother how old are you like to me already this sounds like an old man excuse me if he's not but like under the circumstances that you are talking about of staying with your mother it sounds like you are quite young you don't necessarily have that freedom so this man sounds like somebody who's old who has money and if he's not then well lucky for you because we're all white somebody who has money and somebody that's going to spoil us so girl if deep down here you want to go into the flat just do it don't even over analyze it just do it but at the end of the day you would have had fun and and your mother as well has had her own fair or fair fair as a four has had her own fair chance at having fun during her youth days so YOLO you only live once the next anonymous says I can get I can't get my mind of my marriage it's whom had a things eight months ago. <laughs> you know, this confession right here, it has a lot going on. 
in a short period of time. Number one, eight months. Like that's just like yesterday. And Mogai already is married. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? I'm sure you are. This guy probably had the woman that he married in the picture all along. Because seriously, you can't get married in a short period of time. Like marriage, guys, is a lifetime thing. You can't wake up and just think, okay, yeah, I'm getting married. No. If you can't, just for not. So, you know, this whole situation right now, it, it's disgusting, actually. It's disgusting. I don't even want to overanalyze it because it's very clear and it's very simple. So, you anonymous, you should just leave the guy alone because not even on his worst nightmare, he's going to come back. It's very clear that you are not the one for him, so just leave him alone. Because you, you're just going to hurt yourself. Why do that? There are many fishes out there in the sea. You can get anyone and any, get any, anyone that you want. So please stop it too. That's like, please stop it. Next anonymous says, I'm following Enough with the guy. I don't know about the what? Or maybe I, I need spectacles. And I'm not I'm falling in love with the married guy. We haven't even kissed, but it just makes me happy. I seem I seem to attract guys who are dating or married. Am I meant to be? Honorary search chick. Like, no. Like, uh, mm -mm. I need to put down what, what I've just read here. Because, well, I don't know. The very first sentence that you're watching a married man. What might happen? What are you expecting to to see in future? But because clearly this the very first sentence sold you out. The guy is just using you. Hello, wake up, smell the coffee. Okay? It's not bad. It's coffee. The guy is just using you. Okay? You are just there for him. To use whenever, maybe when he's free or available, I don't know, or lonely. I, I don't know. But fall in love, yo. It's such a strong word. No man. Mm -mm. But I guess why this so? one? You fall in love with a married man. What are you hoping to achieve? Depression, or oh, you're hoping to say that men is a No, like men is No, Papa, are So you, you have nothing in life, perhaps. Please, 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 please. I beg you, okay? I beg you. I beg you. Don't do this to yourself. If you were after the Masha course, because of all of mine, if you're after mine from this guy, just take your mind and explore yourself. Don't get feelings, don't love. Uh -uh. Where is love going? In the matter of men. Valentine's Day with someone's boyfriend 
So it's payback time. <laughs> Do you guys know the song? Wash it up. Hey guys, this is a throwback. I don't know if you need to pay. I don't know. Maybe you will around by the time. But I know the game from the fifth state. I relate because it was a very big, a huge hit that side. So, I don't know, man. I got the guys, man. And I disappoint. Why? Payback? Payback, yeah. Yeah, he payback. Who payback? I in click for banning. Why are you guys fighting each other? I mean, you should be fighting like the other other gender. Like literally. Now when it's other gender plus two points. Maybe not me too. Oh shit, yeah, fine. But guy wasn't gonna agree if Unasaba, okay? How the last two to do it. So I know why? Who likes someone? Hmm? And first of all. I would like to think. Okay. Oh, that's a poor chunk. So when I you should be fighting with the guy and leave when I bat alone. I say brief, I so brief. Stop this. I you know you guys like you are uh, you guys are such a, a sad, 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 sad generation. Like city boys ten, city girls switch. Zero and the box, nothing. And as I don't know, I'm calling it or no one calling it a bad time and go ahead. The way you guys are on about event of war, event of war, this event of war, that you should be also fighting here, Nabo, and not just fight by the looks, fight also mentally and take good decisions. Yeah, but hey. Anyway. Yeah. Let's end the show. Please, guys, do better next time. And please, I mean, the girls must win. What happened to girls ruling the world? You know? Who runs the world? Girls, dads. But at this rate, I'm afraid not. So guys, I'm trying to disappoint that too. Let's do better, guys. So, thank you guys for tuning in. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't. And please share, 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 and follow me on my other social media forms till i hope you guys oh, i hope you guys enjoyed with this video if you guys did please please hit a thumbs up and also if you guys have any suggestions of of videos or anything that i can do that you wish to see me doing Please leave the comment down below. Or if you enjoyed the book bang itself, you can leave the comment down below and then maybe I'll do a little bit of more of the of these next time. So stay safe and don't fight each other, but fight the other gender. So next time, goodbye.